SP Wall provides various solving and meshing options and gives both graphical and text outputs. Once a model creation is completed, click Solve command in the ribbon. The Solve menu containing Solver options and Mesh options will appear in the left panel. The analytical model options including Maximum Allowed Mesh Size, Circle Segments, and Maximum Allowed Aspect Ratio are user inputs that can be changed based on the specific model needs. As a rule of thumb, the results become more accurate as the mesh size and circle segments get finer and the aspect ratio gets closer to 1. The solver portion of the program can be executed using the Run button in the Solve panel. SP Wall generates two types of results, contours and force diagrams. When the run is successfully completed, a contour map showing the displacement envelope in the positive x direction is displayed. Moving the mouse cursor over the contour shows the resulting contour values. Required reinforcement and internal forces are all presented graphically using contour maps. Display options allow users to remove elements borders, show wall deformed and undeformed shapes, and change the deformed shape scale. Nodes and elements numbers can be also displayed. The diagrams scope allows you to study the diagrams of stiffener internal forces and wall cross-sectional forces. Display options here allow the users to toggle diagram fills and values, and change the diagram size as desired. If check concrete shear strength of wall cross sections is selected in the solve options, then the program also generates wall concrete shear strength diagrams. However, these diagrams are produced for solid walls only. The Tables module is accessed from within the main program window by clicking the Tables command from the ribbon. Alternatively, Tables module can also be accessed by pressing the F6 key. The Tables module interface enables the user to view program inputs and outputs in tables and export them in different formats. If the model has not been executed yet, then the tables module will only contain a list of input data tables. When a model has been successfully executed, the tables module will also display the output data tables. Tables can show inputs and outputs for the entire model or for specific range of nodes and elements based on the user needs. The selected ranges apply to all relevant tables. It is also possible to export the results tables to be used elsewhere. Thank you for watching. Please visit structurepoint.org for more information.